learn the controller mechanics for one play touchdowns against man coverage. Coming up next. Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus, the only YouTuber that actually gives you full games of all the tips and skis I post on my channel. I'll show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. All right, so guys, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Also, that notification icon so you can never miss an upload. So guys, I want to go ahead and share a tip. This is maybe for more new players, players that are just getting into Madden, or uh, maybe players that just have a hard time um, throwing long balls. Uh, I don't know if you ever ran into this type of situation before, but you find that sometimes you uh, run into some players that really can always hit you over the top even if you have some coverage out there or they'll always beat you when you have man on man uh, type of coverage where you can't get away with it. Well there are actually mechanics to go ahead and, and, and uh, a way for you to get animation with your long bomb shots and your shot plays. So I want to go and show you how to use your controller to go ahead and do this and I actually have added, added a, a controller icon to this against any kind of man coverage. So as you can see below I've got the controller right here. You can see how I'm going to you know, make the controller. I can, I can use different things uh, to move, move around a little bit and the way the buttons are set up. Obviously if you're on Xbox you can go ahead and, and use the corresponding buttons such as triangle and Y are pretty much the same thing. Uh, but uh, you can look at the controller to get an idea. So I'm going to go ahead and pick uh, a great play for uh, a deep bo uh, bomb against someone who runs a lot of man coverage and that's going to be play action deep seams. Uh, this is something, uh, a play I've actually broken out in my uh, my playbook uh, on the the Cowboys at my Patreon. So if you guys are interested in seeing how I run my, my, my five formation plays in the Cowboys, it'd be great. And I'm just going to use this against random man blitzes and go from there. All right, so uh, basically with this, this is the perfect type of coverage. So if you've got a guy that does a lot of man uh, aggressive man blitzes against you, uh, you're usually going to beat this guy one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. So first thing you want to do is make sure you block all your guys to give yourself uh, a chance. Uh, we got uh, basically uh, probably blitzers coming off the left and the right. Now we're going to look at Hearns. Hearns has got a special route. It's a little dip route. He should get one-on-one -on -one pass defender. And really what you're going to do is you're just going to go ahead and tap the, the passing icon, which would be square or B or a, whatever, whatever, whatever system you're on, and then as soon as the ball's in the air, you're going to hold the right trigger, which is going to be turbo, and then you're going to hit the rack button uh, as you approach the ball. And you should get the animation to go ahead and take this into a one-play touchdown. Tapping it up, turboing, and right there, I'm actually getting a nice big 30-yard gain right there, and more because I've got broken tackles. So this is really, really easy to do. I'm going to block all my guys. I'm going to watch Hearns. If Hearns gets past his, his, his man, I'm going to go and rack that pass and actually get really good, uh, good separation to go and get a touchdown. So if you guys aren't looking already, look in the bottom left-hand corner. This is going to show you how my controller is set up. And basically, you could see that I'm actually getting the animation. I wanted to get a little bit more loft underneath that, but I had to get rid of the ball because uh, the CPU was actually coming in with a very heavy blitz. But let's see if we can get this. This is this is a perfect situation where you can see Hearns beats his man one on one. So guys, if you if you struggle with throwing the long ball, but you're getting the guys, a lot of people playing uh, one on one coverage against you, you might want to go in and consider going to the lab and just practicing this uh, practicing this technique so you can actually get more of these touchdown opportunities for you uh, up top. So if you guys like this tip and you like the breakdown, make sure you smash that like button. Once again, to my subscribers, thanks for support, and until next time.